What is up everybody, welcome back to Gistic Tutorials. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to reduce a PDF file size on Windows. Let's get into it. Okay, so today I'm going to be comparing um, these three different um, online PDF compressors. So the first one is smallpdf.com. Um, these will all be links in the description by the way, and I'll put it in order as I've got it listed here. The next one is free PDF convert. And the last one is PDF compressor. So let's just go straight ahead. Actually, before I do that, I'm going to show you I've got a PDF here. If I go properties, um, you can see it is 19 megabytes, 19.7 megabytes, and it is a .pdf file. So we want to get it to from 19 megabytes down to pretty low. I don't, I don't know how low it's actually going to go because it's, it's hard to judge exactly how much it's going to compress because it all depends on the quality of the PDF file. Um, so I'll just go ahead and show you the quality of this PDF file. It's all black and white. It's very long though. As you can see, there's not too much detail in this PDF file. On smallpdf.com, we're going to go ahead and press choose file. And then we're going to find our PDF file. And then we're just going to double click on it or click on it and press open. And it's going to go ahead and upload first. On the small PDF website, so it will go from 19.7 to 11.8. So that's a 40, it tells you the percentage as well, which is pretty good. So I will show you the pricing after I compress this just to show you what actually works. So just press choose option once you've decided which one is best for you. And then it's just gonna go ahead and compress. This may take a minute or two, or maybe several minutes. It all depends on your internet and the um, file size. After it's finished compressing, you can either email the file, uh, you can copy the link, save as a JPEG, save to your Google Drive, or you can continue to edit. So um, just go ahead and click the download button. And then now it has gone from 19.7 to 5.35 megabytes. And let's see if the quality has changed at all. So as you can see, the quality hasn't um decrease at all so if for some reason you don't like the small pdf you can go to freepdfconvert.com and we can just do the exact same thing um, open open the file find the file double click it and just wait for it to process and then upload okay so it has um finished processing so freepdfconvert.com is going to reduce it by 74 percent which is around the same as the other file so to download it, just go ahead and click the big download button and it's going to go straight ahead and download Then just go, then go show in folder. So I've gone ahead and renamed it. So this has converted it to 5.18 megabytes while the first website did 5.35. So freepdfconvert.com is so far the best one. But we're going to go ahead and um, try out pdfcompressor.com. This looks more like an old school website, but trust me, it is fine. So what you want to do is click the upload files button and then find your PDF file. And then it's just going to go ahead and upload. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you the quality of this one as well. Um, so let's take a look. It doesn't look like the quality has decreased at all. I'm just going to stop on a random page. Yep, so there's no blurry words or um, blurry pictures or anything, so that website didn't decrease the quality either. Okay, so it's finished downloading, and once, it finish, once it's finished downloading, it's going to have a download button, and it tells you how much it's decreased the file size by. Before I download, another th good thing about um, pdfcompressor.com is it actually converts PDF to um, documents, uh, text, JPEG, PNG, so it is, it's, it's, it's a good website for converting PDF files into any of the above files. So go ahead and download. Or if you have more than one, you can download all. And then just go show in folder again. You can exit out of the, um, out of the website now. So this has converted the file to 8.13 megabytes. So you can, um, I'll go ahead and show you the quality. Yeah, it's about the same as the other ones. Maybe a little bit better quality, if anything. Yeah, so the original file was um, 
and then small PDF converted it to 5.3, pdfconverter.com converted it to 8.13, and free PDF converter converted it to 5.18. If you're looking for quality when you convert your PDF files, PDF converter is the way to go. If you're looking for um, the lowest file size, freepdfconvert.com is the way to go. Alright, so that is it for this video. If this did help you, please hit that like button and if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button as well. Leave a comment down below if you have any problems and I'll be glad to help out. That is it from me everybody. Peace out.